Hi friends, welcome to my channel again. In this video, we cover what is OSNET, which is stand for Open Source Intelligence. We're going to talk about the framework and the methodology for the OSNET investigation and some of the top two in OSNET data investigation. Bear with me until the end and you're going to learn more for the cyber security professional purpose. As you all know, reconnaissance is the first step of the cyber security and the foundation to a successful attack. Basically, when you start a IT security investigation, the first phase you will face is the data reconnaissance and intel gathering about your target. Once you finish gathering information about your objective, you will have all the need information like the IP addresses, domain names, servers, technology and much more so you can finally conduct your security tests. What are the best OSNI tools to get this valuable information? Are you looking to track people or company or domain or IP address or running software? We have the right answer to this question. On the question of what is open source intelligence in short OSNET? Well, OSNET is the practice of collecting publicly available information about a target. OSNET play a critical role in the field of cyber security. OSNIT is widely used within the different type of organization, company, public and uh, private agencies. Imagine for a moment all that critical information falling into criminal hand. That could mark the beginning of an attack against your online asset. You can use OSNIT to find a non-public asset or detect outside critical company data or group critical data into useful plan. The first tool or framework we're gonna use today is called OSNIT framework. It's not a tool to be run on your server. It's a very useful way to get valuable information by querying free search engine resources and tool publicly available on the internet. They are focused on bringing the best link to valuable source of OSNIT data. While this web application way originally create focus on IT security, with the time it has evolved and today you can get all the kind of information from other industry as well. Most of the website is used to query the information are free, but some may require paying a lot money or so again for the cyber security professional the first phase in ethical hacking is reconnaissance is also known as a footprinting and information collection or gathering in which we gather as much information about the target as possible also need play a critical role in obtaining information on the target as we discuss in our video right now. Then what is OSNET framework? The OSNET framework is a cyber security structure that consists of collection of OSNET technology that may be used to find information about a target more quickly and easily. It's a web-based platform that allow you to browse several OSINT tools on various terms and go based on your requirement. The OSINT framework focuses on acquiring data through open source tools and resources. It can also be easily browsed looking at OSINT tree and it provides excellent classification of all existing Intel resources. Now you're gonna see 
the actual Osni 3 which is gonna be you, you useful to check so check it around you will notice that there's a lot of there's many category which are given in the shape of a tree in the, uh, our video this including the username email address domain name IP address image video social network instant messaging and you name it so all these are really useful when you need some more information when you click on any of those team a sub tree of useful resource appear and then you got a chance to look carefully so for example if you're looking for an email address and ip address or phone record you can find them all in one place which is why the OSINT framework is so important for cyber security and information discovering and reconnaissance the email address and ip address on OSINT when you are researching for a breach email address then you can find many links to useful resources If you are trying to analyze your network, then the under IP addresses network analysis tool, you can find different tools to analyze the network, such as Wireshark, Network Miner. And also see a map which is a post scanning program that may be useful to identify open port close port or other information however there are numerous additional tools is osnit framework for identifying way to scan port such as zoom eye scan shodan spies and many more for the social networking platform you can learn about social networking platforms such as Facebook, Twitter, Reddit, you name it. You can locate your Facebook and Twitter account and as well a variety of other details. Link it on the other end does not make as much information available to the public. So if you want to do, go to uh, digital, digital currency, the information on digital currency such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, Monero can be found in the tree as well. Fund number as well. You can find many tools. The framework also including tools which make it easier for OSNIT process, such as tools like Multego, Virtual Machine,
Tabi say our video is gonna finish right now as uh, you can see the OSNIT architecture encompasses a huge network of uh, topics, linkages, and tools. There are numerous methods for obtaining information on the target. You must choose the best one for you and you will be amazed at how effective the framework is. is. But again, be careful if you want to use it because it can really breach. You need the permission or you're going to use it for education purpose. My name is Tudor and I'll let you enjoy the rest of the video. If you like my video, don't forget to subscribe, to like, to comment and to share. I hope the video was really good for you and I'll see you to the next video. Thank you very much.